Hey guys, uh, welcome to my channel. Um, today I'm going to show you how to take those index PDFs from GW for uh, Warhammer 40,000 and how to turn them into little index cards that are much more convenient to, uh, to work with. So the first thing you need to do, you're going to have to get the rules. The rules are available at the Warhammer community website. Um, I'll put this link in the uh, description. But basically just download the PDF of whichever army you're looking to print out. Um, in this case, I've downloaded the index for uh, Grey Knights, and I put it in a folder on my desktop called Grey Knights, where I can keep all the files that I'm gonna create here separated. Uh, the next thing you're gonna need to do, we're gonna need two different tools to export this. There's a lot of ways to do this, but um, I've found that using Image Magic is the, uh, the best way to go. It's totally free, um, and uh, it allows you to choose the resolution that you export stuff at. Um, if you use the Adobe product for uh, exporting your PDF, it makes them a really low resolution. And I actually tried that and it gave me poor results. So do this, it's free and really easy. So first thing you need is Image Magic. So to get that, we will go to imagemagic.org slash script slash download. And on here, we'll download the Windows version. You could probably adjust these same instructions for Linux or Mac, but um, I'm just gonna cover Windows here. So we'll just get the latest 64-bit version. I've already downloaded this. So it's just a simple install. Um, just click accept through everything, and just next, next, next. Uh, the other tool we're gonna need is Ghost Script. Ghost Script allows your computer to understand how to handle these PDFs. Um, and in the image magic, we will ch uncheck the last thing here. Okay, so go to the Ghost Script Downloads page, grab the Windows 64-bit version, and uh, this column here is the public license, uh, not the commercial ones. So download that. I've already downloaded it. So just go ahead and install that. You can click Finish here. Okay, so now you have everything you're going to need to extract this. Um, this is all done through a command line. So the first thing you'll do to get that going, uh, click Start, type CMD and open up the command prompt. Now in here, you're gonna have to get to your um, folder where the PDF is. So for me, that's uh, CD desktop, and CD Grey Knights, and this is the folder with uh, my PDF. Uh, so the next thing we'll do, there's just a simple command that will allow us to export every page in the PDF as an image. Um, that command is magic convert dash density 300 resize 100 uh, percent and here you're going to put the name of the pdf in my case it's index dash gray knights uh, you can just start typing it and hit tab um, if there's a space you'll need to have quotes around that uh, and then um, the output name is uh, whatever you want to call the files um, i'm just going to call them gk um, and then uh, you need to use percent %d in the name. Um, I'm going to put percent %d and then .png. So the percent %d is a flag that tells your computer to put um, an index. It'll start with 0 and then go to 1, 2, 3 as you go through each image. Um, so when you hit enter here, it will go ahead and convert all of those images, every page of the PDF, to an image. If you only want a single page, Let's say, for example, in the index, Grandmaster Voldus here got a fix. And GW released an update to the PDF. You just want to extract this, these two pages here. Um, what you'll need to do is figure out what the page number is. In this case, it's page 9 and page 10. Now, um, Image Magic treats page 1 as page 0. Uh, it starts counting at 0. So instead of 9 and 10, this will be page 8 and 9. Um, if you want to convert only those two pages, what you'll do is go down to the where the name is here. Um, it'll be after the quote. And then you'll do a square bracket. Um, and in our case, it will be 8. And then close it. And this should extract just that one page. And we'll do it again for page 9, which is, in fact, page 10. And what you'll see here is uh, for these two pages we've extracted uh, individually, um, this is what they'll look like. They're pretty high resolution. Um, 
if you um, if you want to, you could do a higher number than the 300 DPI. You could do like 600. You'll get very large images. Um, just kind of overkill because the last step is that you're going to take all those images you create and you're going to use a place like CVS or Walmart and just upload them as photos. Um, I used CVS. They had a coupon for 10 cents a page. And so for like 20 some dollars, I was able to print all the Space Marines, all the Space Marines ones. Um, pretty simple and uh, a lot cheaper than getting something official from GW, I'm sure. Plus, whenever there's an update or a change, I'm gonna be able to just get one more picture printed out and I'll have it updated. Um, my plan is to get little sleeves that are meant for photos and just put them back to back. So I'll get like a front and back for each of these. So um, again, um, if you wanted to do this for everything, you just kind of remove that bracket there. Um, and this will export every page as uh, an image. And then these images are easy to go and print. So I um, hope this works for you. Um, thanks for watching this video. If you enjoy this, um, let me know. And uh, I'll catch you next time.